the Joe Rogan experience. Why did you write the book? What what was what was your goal? Like what was when you when you sat down and you decided you're going to write this book, how to fight anti-Semitism? What what were you thinking? Well, first of all, I wrote I was supposed to write another book that I'm still on the hook for. I went and begged my publisher <laughs> to do this because after Pittsburgh, I just kind of couldn't stop seeing it everywhere I looked. Um, and honestly, like, yeah, I, I think if Pittsburgh hadn't happened, I wouldn't have written this first. But I just became so passionate about it and so passionate about he, here's, I, I think, maybe the shortest answer for this. When we talk about anti-Semitism, even you and I, like we think about Jews, like the Jews on the streets of Brooklyn or in Pittsburgh or in that synagogue in California as being the victims of it. But the act, and they are, but the real bigger victim of it is the surrounding society. Like when anti-Semitism shows itself in a culture, it means that that culture is extremely broken or in some stage of death. And the reason that I think it's so important and the reason I ultimately wrote the book is I want people to understand that the fact that anti-Semitism is rising in America says nothing about Jews. It says everything about America and mm. where we are right now. Like, we don't want to become a place where anti-Semitism is normalized because guess what? Societies where anti-Semitism become normalized are societies that no longer exist on the face of the earth. I like how you described in your book as a symptom like that we all have certain bacteria or we all have certain viruses, yeah. but our immune system keeps them at bay. When those viruses show themselves, it's a, it's a sign that the immune system is weak, that the body itself is weak. Yes, that's exactly right. Couldn't have said it better. That's how yeah. I said it. Yeah. yeah, I think that's true. And the question, right, is how do we rebuild back our immune system? And one of the reasons that... I'm alarmed by, I, un I completely understand the populist moment, but I'm also scared of it because um, populism often does not end well for Jews or for the political center. And I think one of, one of the reasons that we need to like, how do we rebuild our immune system? Like those are the sort of things that I suggest in the last chapter of the book. Um, and I think, I just, I just hope we can do them because I'm, really, really alarmed that we're living in an America in 2020 where people I know, you know, who wear a Jewish star, like put it inside their shirt when they walk down the street. That's crazy. Mm. Like that's crazy to me. Imagine if that was a crucifix. If exactly. We, it was the same fear. Yeah. You know? I mean, to say nothing, by the way, of like Jews in France that have, you know, they've been hiding themselves for a very, very long time. That's normal there. Um. You know, I, a lot of Jews I know are taking shooting lessons. I just had a guy reach out to me that was like, I read your book. I've read your speeches. I think you're great, but none of them are going to help you if someone attacks you on the street. Let me teach you like Krav Maga self-defense. Whoa. <laughs> so I'm going to do that. Are you really? Hell yeah, of course I am. Krav Maga is legit. Yeah, I'm definitely doing they it. They basically take the best aspects of all martial arts and combine them together. Striking and grappling, self-defense techniques. I'm going to do it. You're going to get a gun? I can't. I live in New York. You can get a gun in New York. I think it's I know hard a guy. to get. It. Really? Yeah, it's not that hard. I have to tell you, I hate like the few times that I've gone shooting. I hate it. Yeah, I really do. Just go with me. It stresses me out. Okay, I'll go with you. You might enjoy it more. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> okay. Are you serious? Yeah, I'll take you for sure. Next time you're in town, I'll take you to Terran Tactical. Okay, the other light thing up some targets. Okay. <laughs>